Okay, put a finger down if you ever took money out of an old lady's purse. Dang. Oh. That was too easy. Girl, you know everybody do that. That's normal. Okay, put a finger down if you've ever been to prison. Really? You trying to get all of us uh, out. What? Who hasn't been right. to prison? Like, Okay, put a finger down if you've ever taken candy from a baby or been involved in a high-speed chase. Are you kidding me? No, we didn't restart this game. Fair. Put a finger down if you never put the tray table up when the plane is landing. Oh, that's what? not. Uh, no, that's really I not. I can't that. associate with people do like that. Do something like that. Like like that. Something Are you serious? Messed up. What you mean you I'm definitely you looking at you differently, girl. Nah, you got bad energy. No, like, I, I don't feel safe right now. Like, you're not the friend that we thought you were. No, for real. Nah, like, switch seats with me because I don't want to sit yeah, next to uh, her. Uh, I don't feel I'm safe. I'm not sitting next girl, to her. I really think you should go because we really don't want that energy I'm shaking right now. Like, what? So, Sarah, I know that you said that you had a really bit of a traumatic past and the fans really want to know how you overcame that. When I was little, I had this like huge imaginary fear of like ghosts. And every night I used to have this dream of this evil figure with like a chainsaw and like a scary mask. And he was always coming to get me. And I was so scared. Like I could not, you know, it was hard for me to like eat and sleep. And I was so scared. Like I did not know how to navigate through life. And as time went on, I started to tell myself, He's not real. He's not going to hurt you. You're safe. He is not real. And I'm just really proud of all the work that I've been doing to move past it. Wow. I am so happy that you learned to overcome that. And that has made you the woman that you are today. And today, Sarah is going to face her fears right now. What? This is just to really benefit you and bring them out. Hey, Sarah. I'm out to play! No, please, you can't get it. You got that right there. I can't do it. Please. Okay, Zaire, how do you spell BMW? Um, B-E-Y. How do we solve for X? Chosen. You're going to take the square root of Kiat minus Riz, and then you're going to multiply by... Miss Taylor, I need help. Sure, what question are you... <laughs> I know you did not just blow blue raspberry shoelace in my face. Hand no, it over. Put it away. No, put it away. Amiri, can you read the sentence on the board, please? The 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 dog. Uh, I don't even know what that means for real. Like, what does that even say? Amiri, you're a 22 year old senior. Something has to give. Okay, Bella, can you tell us what your project is about? My presentation is on the history of the modern day Civil War. Amazing choice. <clears throat> for seven years, the Barb's and Barty gang have sit down. One, Stop. two, three, I'm talking about me. Okay. That is not even true. Yes, it is. Oh, I'm not talking about you. I'm never going to stop like you play If you see me and you trying to see what's up. See? Okay, Jeremiah, this might be a trick question. What is the shape of that circle? Uh, it's a rectangle. Jeremiah, I just gave you I just don't understand how the girlies that are born in the year 2000 are 24 years old, but I was born in 1865 and I'm also 24 years old. Right. Like, that don't make no sense. Bro, I literally still look like my ultrasound picture. I mean, not really though, but like... No, for real, like, I'm really giving Zygo. Girl, do I look young? Uh, what do you mean by young though? Like, unborn child young? Apparently a newborn baby went missing from the hospital. Like, wah, wah, I'm right here. Girl, Rosa Parks just wrote me a letter asking me what I'm wearing tonight. Girl, I'm not going out to the gathering. I literally look so young. I haven't even washed my face yet, girl. Yeah, I can tell, girl. See, that's why I still look younger than you because I drink from the fountain of youth. Well, the fountain must be contaminated. I'm literally 22. Okay, so why is there a picture of you in my textbook standing next to MLK marching the summer protest, though? Like, isn't that true? That's literally AI. Like, that's not even me. Like, I would You're never- You're literally wearing the same shirt in the photo, though. Okay, well, I would never- I asked Harriet Tubman what time we were gonna get up and leave. And she was like, oh, when I feel like it. Girl, if you don't want me to go with y'all, just say that. Hey, hey, ladies. Hey. Happy birthday, boo. Who's Thank ready you. for Cancun? Hey. 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 Oh, I'm so we oh, oh, are you serious? Not. Did you really just bring your Uh name? Sis, why is Terrence here? Yeah. Oh, I forgot to tell y'all. I, I did invite my man on the trip. Y'all cool with that? Um, I mean, I mean, um, I guess. Y'all not gonna know that he's there. He's like my emotional support. I mean, all right, Hi, sis. Terrence. Whatever. Nah, can y'all turn the music off? Because y'all being mad loud. Like, we're not even being loud. Like, we're in Cancun. Like, what are you talking about? What? Like, y'all so crazy. Like, Hey, boo, I just checked all of us in, and we're going to take our stuff upstairs. You coming with us? Actually, my man and I are going to stay at another hotel. Why? What's wrong with this hotel? We just want to be a little private. Like, that's all. Well, why not just get another room instead of another hotel? Like, isn't that crazy? Well, no, because my man said that he want to be as far away from y'all as possible. So. What? We'll see y'all at dinner, Nigel, We'll see y'all at dinner. 
Hey, hey boo. girl, your hotel is mad nice. Overlooking the water, you got a good room. But anyways, we all getting ready to go out to the beach. Y'all trying to come with us? Of course I'm down. Okay, cool. Baby, you want to go with us? No. Um, okay. Well, my man's not going, so I'm going to just stay back with him. I mean, why can't you just come Bye, out with boo. us? Wait, what are you doing? Baby, can you hold my stuff while I go ziplining? What's wrong? He's not trying to zip line with us? Nah, he said he don't want to go. Nah, because it's mad whack. Like, who <sighs> want to do that? So why did you come if you're not going to do nothing? Right. Like, that makes no sense. Like, why are you giving Why did you come? Y'all so crazy, like... Wait, who got the five surfing turfs? We didn't order this. Thank you. Oh, yeah, it was me and Terrence. Um, so are y'all not gonna pay for it? Because we're not paying for it's that. It's an all inclusive, though. Oh, all -inclusive, but that is not me. Are you so crazy? Doing? Like, okay, sis, what is good with you? Because you've been ignoring us the entire trip. Like, you literally turned this into a vacation. Me and my just wanted to be together and be private. Like, we you're get that, but it's a birthday man. trip. Are you kidding me? It's you didn't even say happy though. birthday. You spent no time. What are you talking about? We were hanging out with us. You didn't want to go exactly. out with us. You Come didn't want to go out with us. I'm not the one that only bought nine dollars on the trip. Like so? it was all like nine dollars. That's there's a chance like, the fact that, that you bought your whole man. You're on the jealous, trip and nobody. You're jealous because you don't even have a man. Oh, so you're making like, like that. Oh, I love that's that. What you're, to me? you're mad. You're weird. You're mad. You're mad. Not even defending you though, he's literally sitting there watching Who you. Who cares? Right? Like, he's not like, defending you. And you doing him. all this for You're what? Like, in for you you have have put yourself in that situation. Like, like, so get 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 this is literally why I do not go on vacation with no females. Like these girls is mad jealous. Babe, remember that time? Nah, shorty, don't put me on camera. I, I wasn't gonna put you on camera. I'm just saying, like, isn't it crazy how? Y'all know this is about to be a serious video when you see the LED lights and no title. So everybody at this point knows what happened with the ban. Unfortunately, instead of worrying about human rights that we all keep asking for, this country is more so worried about a belly dancing app. Imagine having to rock your hips on Instagram. And before y'all be like, oh, they're not gonna ban it, they're not gonna ban it, calm down, you doing too much. I know I joke about, but we gotta be so for real, like, come on now. So I will be moving a lot of my videos to IG and YouTube shorts up here. So I'm just letting y'all know if you still want to see my videos, just follow me on the gram because I'm going to start transitioning onto there. So if you slowly see that I'm posting a little bit less on TikTok more than usual, then that's why. If you still want to keep up with me, then go to my Instagram. My Instagram is also personal, so you'll be seeing my little selfies or whatever, or just me talking on my story. Like, if you really want to, like, keep up with me, not only will I be posting my skits, you guys are just going to see my regular... I'm not going to lie, I ate that. I really ate that up. I ate that up! Don't play with me! Y'all are like, oh, we still got five months. We still got five months. Oh, why are you worried about that? Okay, and then what's going to happen when it's five months? Y'all are going to be cooked and scrambled. And before y'all be like, oh, they're going to sell it. They're going to sell it. They're going to sell it. Imagine working so hard on something that one person forces you to give everything that you have to them just because. Even for some slim chance that this doesn't get passed, still follow me because, you know, I want to be more active on IG. A lot of y'all going to say, yeah, that's not worth it. So let's be realistic. But yeah, guys, that's all I had to say. So go follow me on the This is so unserious. Y'all be DMing me and asking me like in some of my videos and like it's literally on my profile y'all like I don't have it there for no reason and let me know like what more th Let me know what more things you want to see on there in the comments though. Hi, Hi, welcome to Costco. Thank you. Have a good one. Hi. Hello. Thank you. you. Go. Good morning, miss. Can I see? Thank you. <clears throat> good morning, miss. How are you? I'm just going straight to the cat membership. Yes, but I'm only just going to the food membership. Miss, I know that but membership. I I left it in my car. I'm just trying membership. to membership. Miss, I'm only going to get the Ma'am, if you don't have a membership. I know that, miss, but I'm only here to go straight to the Give me your membership! Ah! 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 Please! <laughs> miss, I'm just going to the cafeteria to get up a slice of pizza! Not me getting jumped again? <coughs> oh my bad, friend. My bad. You know, you, you should have said that earlier. I was you know, trying to go inside. How my leg is. Have broken. a great experience. Hi, welcome to Costco. Mm -mm 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 um, hello? Are you wasting my food? Because I know you're not wasting my food that I just spent my hard-earned money on. No, I was trying to make something I saw on TV. With my groceries that I just bought? What's in there? What is that? Speak up, child. Mustard, chocolate syrup, pickles, cottage cheese, sprinkles. Cookies, marinara sauce. That sounds absolutely delicious. Now go ahead and eat it for me, baby. What? You heard exactly what I said. Now you made it, now you better eat it. Go on, bon appetit. But, but, but I don't want to eat it. Oh, you definitely gonna eat it all right. And you're not gonna leave this kitchen until you do.
Oh, you got an issue now? Since you wanted to be creative and now you don't want to eat it? I don't want to. No, now you have to. Now you're going to eat it all while I'm standing here. And I'm not going to leave until you take a bite. Eat it. Yeah, eat it. You out here wasting my mustard when there's other children out there that are begging to have some mustard. Mommy, I don't want to eat it. I bet you're not going to be Chef Boyardee again. I bet you not. I bet you not. My name is Jordan. I'm 37. And I'm looking for that woman I can sweep off her feet for real. So what are you looking for? Someone who's not afraid to be vulnerable and loves to show emotion. I'm really ready for that next step in love. I definitely want to be engaged one day. Yeah, I want to be married too. Of course, that's why we're here looking for marriage and love. No, 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 no. I, ju I just said engaged. I'm not really good with my emotions, but I'd really love to try. So what do you look for in a relationship? I love a man who isn't afraid to cry. Someone that can... No, I, I gotta go. That's too emotional for me. All my life, I've been focused on the wrong things and... I've been looking in the wrong places for real. So what is your ideal person? A man that's sweet, caring. All I want is a woman to get to know me for me and not just what I got on the outside. Can you like describe what you look like? Um, that literally defeats the purpose of the experiment though. Oh, so you hiding something? Growing up, I was misunderstood in a lot of my relationships and it took me some time to heal and I'm still a work in progress. But I just want to get to know somebody who doesn't care what I look like for real. Uh, how you doing? Hi, how are you? I'm like so nervous. <laughs> you got a beautiful voice. Really? Thank you. What's your name? I'm Jordan. What's your name? My name is Keisha. You a sister? Is that a deal breaker? I have seven kids and I'm hoping that my future woman would be accepting of that and all of my kids. So I have a 10 year old daughter. Um, what do you think about that? That's interesting, but... It doesn't matter your race. It doesn't matter your size. It doesn't matter what you look like because I'm going to love that person for them. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, is something wrong? What the? Did I do yeah, something? I, like, are you serious? I thought you was going to be bad. You said I am. you was what bad. Are you so why, why are you not bad in person? That could you, not be bad. Bad. you guys, I have devastating news. What happened? Is everything okay? I'm leaving. <clears throat> You guys, there's bagels in the break room, y'all. Aisha. Oh, gosh. You know you're one of my favorites, right? You literally told on me for coming in late. I would like for you to have this tape, since I won't be needing it anymore. What? Mondays, am I right? But this is my last Monday. <laughs> Who's gonna miss me? <clears throat> Lashana, I am going to miss you the most. My name is Lauren, and we never work together. Hey, Tyler, now that we're no longer co-workers, you should unblock me from social media now. I think I'm good. When's the due date on that? Client wants it by March 9th. <gasps> no, but I'm leaving March 8th. And then he told me the assignment was due on the 9th, but I was leaving March 8th. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're so lucky. You guys, I'm giving away free pens because I won't be needing them anymore since I'm leaving. Who wants my pens? We should totally hang out and keep in touch. Yeah, we should. I'm definitely down. When do you want to hang out? Sometime this decade. I'm literally so bored. You could help us on a project you'd started. But I'm leaving. So when is the secret party that you guys are having? Oh, it's going to be on March 9th. But I'm leaving on the 8th. Well, yeah, exactly. Melanie, do you like that Applebee's gift card that I got you? Yeah, thank you so much. But I noticed it was used already. They called me and told me over the phone. Uh, hello? This just in. Are rats now obligated to pay New York State taxes? And do zebras now have human feet? We're going to take it over here with Rachel live from Lower Manhattan. I oh know. Oh my gosh, here's yes. this new spot in Soho that I really want you guys to go to. Can we cross? What are you guys doing tonight? I think I want to go. I know, I literally. What are you guys doing for happy hour? Um, can you please go around me? We're filming for the news. Ugh. Yo, I want to be on TV. Yo, dude. I dude, dare you to dude, walk in front of that lady. <laughs> Are you guys all getting a cab? You want to come to dinner? Hey, yo, shorty! You better back up. Cause Rachel, we're live. Heavy. Rachel. Hi. Thank you, Nancy. We are live from... I love you. Yeah, me too. Imagine if I cheated right now and messed everything up. Did you check the weather today? I don't know. Yeah, it's cloudy with a chance of cheating. I'm, I'm, um, oh, I feel a sneeze coming in. Actually, Oh, my chest. Oh, no. Are you having a heart attack? No, I'm just feeling the urge to cheat. 
listen, I'm not going to make promises, but there's a huge chance that I might cheat. Okay, what are the chances that you think that might happen, though? About, like, 99%. Okay. Babe, why are you staring at me like that? You're so beautiful. I really hope I don't cheat on you, for real. Clay, fight it! Ugh, fight the urge I'm cheat. trying! Fight Ugh. it! I'm not trying to, like, start nothing, but, like, what would you do if I cheated? Listen, I just want to warn you that I might cheat on you because my dad cheated, so, you know, it might be, it might be a little rough. Could you let me know in advance, like, when you might cheat? Um, well... The feeling kind of like comes and goes. Right. Sometimes on Saturdays I get the urge to cheat because mm -hmm. like that's like my biggest day. Right. Um, Wednesdays is a little iffy. Okay, I'll um, write down Wednesday. But you know, today's Sunday, so we should be good. Okay, so like let's pretend that I cheated, right? Um, would you still be like my lifelong fiance? Okay, right now it's just me and you. But if I add a third party, now this is gonna be a snooze fest. <laughs> See, I wouldn't have gotten that dress. I told Amanda the mermaid dress was a lot better. She's my sister. Of course I'm happy she's getting married. You want some? It's peach flavored. See, if I actually accepted Terrence's DM request 41 years ago, that would have been me up there. Listen, I heard there was going to be fried calamari at the reception. That is why I'm here. <laughs> Does anybody object? Should I? <gasps> I'm kidding! I'm kidding. <laughs> Those vows were beautiful, I have to say. Do you guys know who's performing at the- Shut up! <laughs> okay! Up oh, there he is. Where is he? Is that him? Yep, right there. What's up, Daddy! woman? How you doing? Hi, Amiri. Hi. You must be the famous Amiri your daddy was telling me about. Happy birthday. Thank you. Hi, you must be Kayla, right? I'm Amiri's mother, Shanice. Yeah, I am. Well, it's so nice to meet you. Devon didn't tell me he was bringing somebody to the party, but that's all right. Thank you for bringing a gift as yeah, well. Yeah, well, I'm the stepmother now, so it's really important that I need to be at these events because I'm clearly in the picture now, so yeah. I mean, this is me and my son's first time meeting you, so... Yeah, well, honestly, it's about time that we met considering all the things that I've heard about you. Oh, really? What did you hear about me? Come on, baby. She not worth it. This is not the time and the place to do this. Not because I don't no, know. No, no, because I'm tired of letting her walk all over you. <laughs> you just stand up for yourself. Over. So I'm gonna stand up for my man. Devon, really? You're literally a terrible person and you didn't even let Devon see his son. <laughs> Excuse me? Oh Baby girl, gosh. you have no idea what's been going on. So please stop. Devon is a very hardworking and dedicated you man so who is delusional. a good father. What? And the fact that you're taking that away from him is I so can't, heartless I can't. and so insensitive. Okay. You're just mad because of the fact that he moved on and what? you didn't. And he's happy where First he is. First of all, Devon is more than welcome to see his son anytime that he wants to. He has not called or asked to come visit. So I'm not keeping him away and respectfully i think you need to mind your business it is my business no, because is i'm not. in the picture now this is between me and devon well devon and i have been dating for three days oh, and he please. told me that he would never do me like how he, he did said you. that to so everybody. that's why you're mad Who's that's mad? literally why you're Who's mad baby let's go she's not worth it you are definitely no, not worth it because you don't understand how baby, horrible don't even you are give her to no devon attention. and you're hurting really, devon? your whole like, family that's not a great that's not right don't even entertain her she's not even worth it that's not right so tell me about the relationship. It just constantly like made me question like my self worth a lot. Uh huh. What were some of the things that he did to make you feel that way? Well, he always called me worthless mm. and like he told me that my face was shaped like a shovel uh -huh. and like literally I. Oh, just... looks like we have run out of time. Yep, you're done. Okay, let me just pull up my calendar. Oh, All right, um, so next week I'm going to Vegas, so I can't talk to you then. How about Monday at eleven? Yeah. Actually, I have court, yeah. so I can't do that. Let's do Wednesday. Sounds good? That, yeah, that's totally fine. We can do next week. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to pencil you in for that. My other client uh -huh. is waiting. So. Yeah. All right, honey. Keep your Thank head you. up, all right? Have a good one. Hi, sorry. Um, Can you point me to where the Shea Moisture products are? Sure. Are you athletic? Yes, but what does that have to do with it? Why were you? Excuse me. You are gorgeous. Keep folding them clothes like the queen that you are. Are you recording me? Yes, I am. Excuse me. Do you have the keys nope. to the... <sighs> okay, we're almost there. Keep following me, okay? down. But oh my gosh, not serious. Stop flaring. Right, I got any more toilet paper in the back. I didn't see it in the aisles. No. What the? You're not even going to... Miss, why do you keep running from me? Like... Um, I see you mark those as yellow onions, but those are actually Vidalia ah! onions. Okay, your total is going to be $248.62. Would you like to apply for our Circle Rewards member card? Nah, I'm okay. Thank you, though. I guess I'll, I'll do it today. That's what I thought. <laughs> Hi, I'm Rachel. I sold my soul to be here. Well, so... you need to go buy it back because you're not getting paid. Wait, what? My name is Kiara Monet, and I have no goals in life. Ladies and gentlemen, a baddie.
I want to bring that positivity and uplifting to baddies and not always just fight. Nick, knack, patty, whack, give a dog a bone. Nah, come yes. on, come on. Yes. 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 Like, yes. Yes. Real see, rap that's is that. That's what I like to see. That's, that's what I like right. to see. Hello, my name is. Why you got ombre hair? What? Who has ombre hair? Why you got ombre? Why your lashes look like ombre? that? Why your lashes look like that? Listen, I'm going to give you a ticket and you smack her. Um, what? No. I'm not going to smack you. What? Come here. What you going to do? Come here. What you going to do? I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. Get it, yes. What's your biggest accomplishment in life? Honestly, probably being the first in my family to graduate college. Oh, so you think you're better than us? No. What are your thoughts on climate change? What is that? Give her a ticket. She a baddie. Yeah. She a baddie. Yeah. She a baddie. <gasps> Next. What? What are we going to do? Wait, Jason. What's up? If we don't make it out of here, there's something I have to tell you. Of course. Let's have a sentimental moment right now. What is it? I'm in love with you. Wait, what? Wait, how long? I've been in love with you since third grade at recess. That's a long time. And I've been feeling the same way about you. I was afraid of what you'd think, but now I'm glad you told me. <laughs> oh man, what do we do? We gotta get out of here. You go this way and I go that way, okay? All right, we got this. Okay. Wait, Sasha. Yeah? I just wanted to say good luck out there. Hi, welcome to Ulta. Where are the molecules at? It's right in our skincare section all the way to the left. Do you guys carry Glow Recipe here? We don't carry that here, but we do have some Shoshito products that we can really- Does the Hannah Evans use that? I don't know who that is and I'm not Then sure. I don't want it! Dad, 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 dad. Excuse me, do you guys have any more sugar, honey, apple pie, watermelon, bubblegum, waffle cup serum? I can't recommend you that, but sweetie, you're so beautiful. Your priorities should be studying. And you look like a rotting banana at 23, so oh. clearly you don't know where your priorities are. Oh my gosh, I just got the last ordinary serum. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. <laughs> Yeah, where's your bubblegum retinol? Sweetie, I don't think you should be using retinol like that on your skin. I just... Well, judging by the looks of you, you should be using retinol yourself. Uh... So me and you can both look for it together. Yo, where's your Elemis anti-aging cream? Honey, is the aging in the room with us right now? Even I don't use anti-aging cream. Like, there should really be a limit on- And I thought the age limit to work here was 50 years old, but clearly you're here. What? Sweetie, I'm 21 years old. Like That's a hard 21. Maybe we should get the anti-aging cream together. Mom. 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 Mom, mommy. Ooh, Urban Decay, that's such a good choice. I use it all the time. It's so- Clearly you don't use Urban Decay because you still look like you're Urban decay -ing. What? Okay, sweetie, your total's gonna be $6,782.41. Emily, which one should I put back? Are you serious? Okay, put this one back. No, I need that one to make my pineapple smoothie. No. Dad, can you come inside? I need 47 more dollars and I'm at the register right now. Sweetie, why don't you just step aside while I can just help out other people and then when you're ready. <sighs> my dad is Boom. coming oh, in a my. minute. He's only gonna be here in 40 minutes. <sighs> Finally. Guys, she just restocked it. There they are. Wait a minute, oh my gosh. What's wrong? Oh, oh, wait, I, 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 before you guys can I just get a single file? Hi, my beautiful angel. I'm so glad the universe brought us together. And thank you for booking with me again. Now, let's see what the universe got in store for you today, baby. Okay, let me just shuffle my cards and pull up your questions. <clears throat> okay, so your first question is, even though you said no 26 times, is Levante still coming back? No! No, he's not! I'm sick of you asking me this question every single time that you come here. He's not coming back. Get over it. Love yourself. You telling me you could have been sitting with a Prince Charming, but you sitting here crying over a bum that don't wash his sheets, let alone his bond. Oh, look. Look at the time right now. It's 1.11 p.m. on the dot. That means your intuition is telling you that he is a bum and you need to leave him. I don't know how many times I got to tell you that your Delulu will never become true Lulu. That man cheated on you, wiped out your bank account, and turned you against your family. And you still want him back? Spirit, you better calm me down. You better calm me down. You better get me back on my level, Spirit. What you need to be doing is manifesting a job because you clearly making me rich. You really keeping me in business, baby girl. Because you blocking your blessings over a man that be calling himself Booger. You need to learn to find that true love within yourself before you come looking for a man. Oh, okay. Sorry about that. Next question. Is Levante my soulmate? No! No, he is okay. not my soulmate! Dang! I love your ring. Thank you. He got it from Pandora. Wow, that is so Excuse good. me. Can I get everybody's attention, please, real quick? <clears throat> Thank you, y'all, for coming to our engagement party. I just want to give a special toast to my soon-to-be wife, the future Mrs. Robinson! Oh, oh, come on, Shauna! All right, all right, all right. But Shauna, 
You've been here for me for a very long time. You stayed in a 21 year situation with me while I was working on myself, and now I'm finally ready to settle down. That's Even though the woman you. I actually wanted to marry already said no, you stepped it up. You stepped it up. You and have then, allowed me to cheat on you multiple times, and you still took me back, and that's how I know you are a good woman. And when I cheat, I always feel so disgusted. But to make myself feel better, I always be thinking about you every time I cheat. You make the best meals. I look forward to coming home every night after a long day of cheating because I know where my home is. Mm. Yes. Thank you for accepting my proposal. And even though I was using you as a placeholder to get the girl that I actually wanted, but that girl ended up getting married to another man. So I realized that she was the one this whole time. I was blind. I didn't see it. And even though I cheated on you with all of your homegirls, that just shows that they were fake friends. And the only real friend you got is me. Come on now! And even though I turned you against your whole family and made you choose me over them, that just shows that you're loyal, mm. trustworthy, mm. and you are good enough to be my wife. Yes! Come on. You have really showed me what loyalty is. And you is a down chick. Yes, she really is. a down chick. And that's why I love you, Shauna. I still might cheat in this marriage, but at the end of the day, I'ma always come home. That's yes. what it's about. Girl, you snagged a good one. I can't wait for it to be my turn to be picked. So I already took up most of y'all time, but with that being said, cheers everybody to Shauna. Yes, okay, so happy career Stop. day. I see each and every one of you are dressed up. I'm gonna go around the room and ask to see what you guys wanna be when you grow up, okay? Shh, be quiet. All right, Jason, what do you wanna be? I'm dressed up as a SoundCloud rapper. Are you serious? Yeah, you said career. Oh, okay. Uh, Dior, what, what are you dressed up as? I'm dressed up as Jada Waiter. I'm also a rapper's baby mama. Are you Ari? Yes. Chance, I know both your parents are lawyers. What do you want to be? I want to have a podcast where I spread my ridiculous views and talk about females all day. Um... Okay, Paris Rain. I'm gonna be a lash head because, like, to be honest with you, your eyelashes kind of look bad. Sincere. Either a dentist or a scammer. I'm not really sure yet. Kaden. I want to be like Tristan Thompson when I grow up. Amiri. My daddy unemployed, so I want to be like him. But if I do get a job, I'm gonna rock my hips on TikTok. Bella, Bella Dream. I want to be like Natalie Nunn and be on Baddies East. Girl, I also put that, I put that I want to be Krishan. Jesse, my smartest student in the class. What do you want to be when you grow up? I want to be a famous actress. Okay, that's reason. On Tubi. Okay, I quit. Hey, so I've been thinking about this a lot and sometimes being an influencer is kind of hard. So I was thinking about maybe hiring an assistant. So yes, the rumors that all two of you have been spreading were true. I'm hiring an assistant. I do not have the application in front of me, but these are a few of the things that I look for in an assistant. So number one, the salary is gonna be about $400 a year. I feel like that's kind of fair. $400 is like way too generous, so maybe like 350, but yeah, I feel like that's fair. And yes, I will be also taking out taxes. What I'm also looking for is that I want you to be available at least 23 hours a day, and you do get a nine minute lunch break, so that's like a total plus. Also, because I'm an influencer, I expect you to take every single picture of me. I am also looking for a therapist, so you must allow me to trauma dump on you. Also, you must be responsible for my Instagram captions. Pink Friday 2 just came out. There are no excuses for no captions. And you also have to be commenting and liking every single post that I make. If you don't, you will be fired. Also, if we're out in public together, do not post a location. Also, when we go out, there's like a hierarchy thing. If we are at a restaurant and ordering food and your food just happens to come before mine, you must wait for me. And when my food comes, you must wait until my camera eats first. Then I eat. Then you can eat. To be honest, it's just really insensitive, tone deaf, and unsafe at the fact that I'm recording a video and your half bitten sandwich is on the table. Like, ew. Also, another simple task is I want you to check all of my emails, even on holidays. I, like, like, that's, like, everything I'm saying is so, like, bare minimum. Also, once in a blue moon, as a perk, you do get PR packages because I receive so many, but you'll only get them if I do not like them. And that's kind of rare because I usually like my PR packages, so you kind of won't really get anything. Sometimes the packaging, the boxes are really cute. Like, you might keep the box. Also, this job does not have any paid time off, so any days that you miss, like let's say if you want to go on vacation, your salary will be deducted. Also, if I were to ever be canceled, you will be taking full responsibility on my behalf. And if you don't, I will still say it was you. Okay, I think that's everything. Let me know if you want to apply. Applications open on Christmas Day. Bye!
Girl, I was deleting my drafts on TikTok. And then I forgot to tell y'all that I ended up going to TikTok headquarters literally two months ago. Why did I forget to tell y'all that? Ah! I done sold all my other socials, but I didn't even tell TikTok. Like, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. This was like two months ago, right? Because clearly I had a wig and I had like my brows or whatever. But TikTok invited me to their New York office. I'm so mad I didn't tell y'all. Like, what the? But this was for like a one minute creator event where they kind of come up with new features and introduce it to us. I'm sure they're out right now. I was so nervous. I'm not even gonna sit here and lie to you because i'm just not that type of social in real life but when i tell you that everybody was so nice i got to meet so many different people i got to make a lot of new connections we ended up learning some tips and tricks from tiktok so that was really nice and we got to speak to some um really big creators who came to like give us advice and stuff like that and you know their journey on tiktok and then after that, we went to like a little happy hour and I got to socialize with a lot of different people. I was so nervous. Like I have really bad social anxiety, so that's why I don't really like to go to a lot of events. Fun fact. But talking to a lot of creators just really made me feel super comfortable. Oh, they have this little ice cream station where you could catch the ice cream. Oh, yeah. What is what is that? I don't know how much I filmed. Oh, wait. This is when me and my homegirl ended up getting nachos right after because we was mad hungry. So, yeah, the nachos was good. Also, do not bring guacamole to go. It's going to be nasty. Dang, that's it. But thank you guys so much for even allowing me to get to TikTok HQ. Like, I wouldn't have done it without y'all. Like, what? Hey, Janae. Hey. I noticed that your team's notification was yellow for five minutes. What were you doing, like, during those five minutes? Well, I had to get up and use the bathroom. Okay. Am I not allowed to Okay, go? well, if you're going to go to the bathroom, you got to let me know. I know I'm not your boss, but I am on a higher level than you. So not I can really. tell you what to do. I'm not saying that I don't trust you, but I'd rather be CC'd on every single email that you send. Why? Okay, so I noticed that you sent this email, but, like, I didn't get a chance to check it first. So, oh. you know, moving forward. So I noticed that you put this in your email, but, like, like, honestly, that's not how I would have done it. Okay. I mean, I have been here longer than you. See, if that was me, I would have done that in, like, five minutes. I'm just saying that, like, this is, like, the right way to do it, even though you don't have to follow it, but it is the right way. I just want to remind you that I've been here longer than you, so I know a lot more things than you do. Wait, where are you going? I'm going on lunch since it's 12 o'clock, and that's when we all take lunch. I get that everybody goes to lunch at 12, but you should still let me know because oh. if I don't know where you are, it's going to be like a real big disaster. So like moving forward. So two plus two equals four. I'm sorry. She's a little new here. So please disregard everything that she just said. And I'm going to tell you the exact same thing that she said, but it sounds a lot better coming out of my mouth. So two plus two is four. What? Who entered this in? Um, I'm not going to say names, but I did show Janae already how to do it. And I had her do it by herself. You told me to. Okay, Janae, we're going to have a little chat in like my little office. Okay. Um, I feel like you should have informed me when you were going to the bathroom because that's just not really team player vibes. Hey, so next week, I'm going to need you to work oh, on... Oh, I'm going to be out of office all next week, though. Chris actually uh, approved my PTO, so I'm going to be all out next week. Was I informed about that no because i went directly to our boss and he okay i know he's our boss but i'm kind of second in command so i should know about every single thing that hey the billing department just let us know about the whole situation but i took care of everything though okay i kind of want to piggyback off of your email because i don't really like what you just said and i don't trust you no so but everything was canceled hey like frank jumping in here i was your reading yeah. reports by end of day morning guys <gasps> oh my god Who's oh that my gosh girl? she looked great la, la, no la, la, wow la, 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 I think that she comes up with a new hairstyle. I thought she was That's sick insane. yesterday. Is that why she clocked out? Must have been some sick day. Didn't she have a bob yesterday? How I saw her with a 613 bust down at lunchtime. I need whatever she's having in her hair. This is her third it's style real, this right? week. Or is it like, is it like plastic or is it real? Like, I don't think it's real. You never look good. I'm obsessing. Never look good. We are so obsessed. Is she Harry well. Potter? Because I think she a witch girl. That's some sorcery Macaroni, right there. Macaroni, cheese, and rice. Oh my goodness. Khadija. You look Khadija, amazing. Khadija, that's crazy. You look like a new person. I almost did not Khadija recognize Khadija from accounting? That's insane. No way. Khadija, I'm dying to know. How long did that take? Six hours. Yo, no, no, no way. I was in the chair for that long. Wow. I'm telling you, I wouldn't I be able to do it. I wouldn't be able to do it. I really don't know. I couldn't do this it. This looks amazing Khadija, on you. I love this color. give us a 360 color. a little bit. Whoa. Ah. Whoa. Whoa. Ah. Whoa. Ah. Whoa. No way. Oh, my God. That was amazing. Don't whack us oh now, Khadija. Don't do that. That was Khadija, amazing. I am that was so obsessed with you. Wait, so does she grow her hair overnight? That's what How I was saying. Me color? and Betty from Finance were saying the same thing. Like, she looks so good. Wow, we love wow. your hair, girl. You went we from love. Fantasia to Erica Badu in less than 24 hours. That's the same yes. Hi, Amanda. I just got your IM. You said you needed to talk to me? Hi, Fatima. Yes. <sighs> um, Come in, honey. You okay. Just close the door. You're not in trouble at all. Okay.
Also, I don't want to be like rude or anything, but my name is Fatima, not Fatima. You keep saying Okay, it see, wrong. that's what I wanted to talk to you about is that aggressive tone. You aggressive. Know? You know, Fatima, some of your coworkers are a little bit concerned about your hostility. They feel that your personality is very aggressive and unsafe. And, unsafe? You know, we don't really want that, right? But I mind my business and I do my work and I even work overtime a lot. Like, how is Honey, that? I have gotten cornrows on my vacation in Jamaica before. So I see you. And I hear you. What? You know, your quiet personality has caused a lot of havoc. And they don't think it's healthy in this situation. I'm sorry. I don't really understand how that's considered havoc. You know, I don't really know if they do that in your hood. What? But at Parker Solutions, we don't really do that here. Okay, I literally yeah. cannot believe you just whoa, said that to whoa. me. Calm down, sister. Don't pop off. Honey, I just want to see where your head's at. I'm just here to get down to the nitty gritty, the pit, the core, the bottom, the glute, the donkey of things. I just want to know if you are okay. I'm fine. To make this environment completely safe because we are all a family here and we are so worried about you. Is this about Rachel from Billing? All I said is that I don't want to be called that sis. Like, Fatima. I give up. We at Parker Solutions want to ensure that you are comfortable. And Rachel has informed me that she meant no harm. She even looked it up on Urban Dictionary and she said it was a term of endearment. But that's not whoa, really- Whoa, whoa, whoa. See how you're raising your arms like that? That is the aggression that we're talking about. Are you serious? All I am saying is that you should engage more. You don't go to happy hours. You don't talk. You just do your work and go home. You know, you don't like to try the food at our potluck. You know, Brian from accounting even saw that you spit out his casserole and he was- we all spit it out. That. Like, we just want you to be a team player. I didn't think that was part of my job description that you I had. You know, I feel like you and Shaniqua from accounting would be great friends. And you should definitely talk to her more. I thought you guys were sisters, obviously. Her name is actually Sarah. And we're not sisters. So You're not? No. And before you go, one more thing. Fatima. Fatima, I was going to say that. I was going to say that. You definitely were you not, are but. on your team. We love you. What? Okay, so unfortunately, I have another list of things that I learned from being on social media in 2023, except this is within the past seven days. Okay. You are not allowed to have vacation highlights in your Instagram bio. You are not allowed to eat alone in public. You are not allowed to have LED lights in your room. You are not allowed to cry at your own wedding, especially if you are a man. You are not allowed to eat free bread at a restaurant because that is big back behavior. You are not allowed to wear an Apple Watch at a formal event. You must apply for Social Security after turning 30. Men who eat oatmeal for breakfast or drink smoothies are considered sassy. You are not allowed to have your phone on Do Not Disturb or that means that you are a narcissist who is terrible at maintaining relationships, lack communication skills, and, of course, have avoided attachment style. You are not allowed to wear macage jackets because they are childish. You are not allowed to wear a bonnet in public or on social media. You are not allowed to do your own hair because that is broke behavior. You are not allowed to say that you do not want kids because that is selfish. As a man, you are not allowed to have a skincare routine or take care of your fingernails because that is sassy. Black or brown lip liner is ghetto. You are not allowed to fly Spirit Airlines even if you were just simply trying to save money. You are not allowed to eat at Chili's. You are not allowed to shop at Ross. You are not allowed to have almond-shaped nails. You are not allowed to be too loud or excited or you will be broken up with. You are not allowed to be in the gym for New Year's Day because you are taking up space. Please don't bring this into 2024. Hi girls, welcome to Sephora. Can Lady, I you got drunk elephant or not? Oh, it, it's over there. Oh my gosh, Izzy, I see it. <laughs> Hi, my friend and I are looking for the rare beauty blushes. Oh, the rare beauty blushes are gonna You're be- You're a liar. I checked already and it wasn't even there. You're not even doing your job properly, lady. Is there like a specific shade that you're looking for? Show her the picture. Show the lady the Let picture. Let me find it. No, let's go over there and show her. Over here. My friend's going to take you and show you. Come on. <laughs> okay, so we ran out of the shade in Courage, but we do have Lucky, which works just as good. That's what I asked for. 
I literally wanted it in a specific shade. I wanted it in courage, and you bring me the wrong shade that I did not ask for. My dad, who is the president of Timu, will not be happy about this, and you'll be out of a job. Excuse me, do you guys sell the ordinary here? No, honey, but I can suggest wishful skin. Ah, you're so useless. Excuse me, which retinol product do you recommend? Aren't you like nine? FYI, I'm actually turning 10 tomorrow. So basically, where's your mother? Okay, sweetie, your total is going to be $10,364.62. Is your mom or dad going to pay? Uh, no, I just took it out of my life savings. So technically, it's my money that I'm going to be uh, Sweetie, using. I don't think Are that's you dumb. I said it was my money, you potato with lashes. What? Yeah, I'm just waiting for more people to come on. Hey y'all. What happened? Um, no, I just be <laughs> up. No, clearly I won though. Like, what are you talking about? No. She didn't get no scratches on me, like. Why am I wearing sunglasses? Because it's bright in here. Like, y'all don't be wearing sunglasses to the club. Like, why do you have an ice pack if you didn't get... Because I have a headache. Like, I can't have a headache. Like, nah, here's what happened. She was talking about my twerk air, and I, I just came to her house, and I pulled up, you know, because I'm really about ass down on business. So... Are you in? No, I'm not cool with her no more. Because how you going to talk about, oh, I'm about it. I'm going to support you. You know, I always write for my girl. And then all of a sudden, you got a doctor's appointment. Exactly. Like, that's fake. Like, she was really never my friend. Like, she's always been jealous of me. Tell me how her dude been cheating her, though. Yep, he been cheating on her with nine different girls, like, exactly. And I kept that from her, because, like, I was trying to be a good friend, but you let me fend for myself, so now I'm going to air out your so. Exactly, right. Where are y'all getting this, oh, she got whooped from? Like, I did not get whooped. Where do you see the whooping? Like, where do you see the whooping? I'm over this. Like, I'm really done. Like, I'm done. Because, like, I clearly won the fight. Like, what are you talking about? Like, now, La Joshua, would you like to read your vows to your wife? Oh, I ain't write nothing. My bad. You know what? You know what? I'm going to just, I'm going to just speak it from the heart. All right, here it goes. Man, Shauna, we finally made it. We finally Ooh. doing this for real, man. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm. First off, let me start by saying this, Shauna. I know what you thinking, man. It's about... Bow. Dang time! Yes, yes, Finally, y'all! I know, y'all! I know! I, I, know. I should have been did this! You well, think? 21 years of a situation ship and 9 years of being engaged? Man, we really doing well, it, man! I know. I mean, I'm gonna be honest with you, I'd rather be standing up here with another woman, but I settled for you, and I'm grateful for that. But in all seriousness, Shauna, I just love how committed you are to not loving yourself, mm. and how you constantly have low self-esteem. I promise to always disrespect you. Yes. Make you my doormat. And cheat on you with another woman to make you raise her child. Because I know you will never leave. Never. Mm -hmm. never right. Ever leave. And the fact that none of your family members are here today just shows that you are committed down woman. Mm. The fact that you're just so easy to manipulate and... I'm getting emotional, man. La Joshua, take your time, baby. Take your Whoa! time. The fact that you agreed to not get a prenup even though you make 100K a year and I don't have a job, you are selfless. <sighs> all right, that's all, that's enough because um, that's all, really all I got to say. I now pronounce y'all husband and doormat. You may kiss your bride. Whoa! All right, y'all. Yeah! Oh, Mom, please tell me everything's going to be okay, man. I'm just so happy that my babies is here with me and safe. Ma, we came as soon as we could. Yeah. yeah. Ma, how come you didn't tell us you had fibromyosis, Gerana Lahalja? Exactly. I didn't want to upset nobody. I didn't want to be in nobody's way. What? Oh, come on, I just Ma. wanted y'all to live your lives, and I didn't want to be a burden. Ma, no, you were Ma. never a burden. You could have told us, Ma. We would have Ma, been there. from this day forward, I will not be in the streets no more, Ma. 
I promise That's you. That's good baby. to hear. Your son needs you, baby. I'm gonna be I'm there sorry, for you. I'm sorry, ma. I've been busy with all the kids. I didn't even notice. Me neither. Me too, ma. I promise I won't cheat on my girl no more. We're gonna make it right, ma. Yeah, ma. Me too. I'm gonna make changes with my life too. Starting today. Is Ashley here? I don't we know tried calling her, but she wouldn't pick up her phone. She's not coming. No, I don't, we don't think know. so, ma. I'm sorry. <sighs> we left her a voicemail. Call her cell phone. I'll try her again. Ma, I got a question for you though. What is it, baby? What is your password to your online banking account? No! no! Mama, no! Yo, I always get mistaken for being a newborn baby all the time. They really think I'm a baby. Like, people be telling me all the time that I look 19. Yeah, in dog years. See, I'm 48 and I literally look 18. But wasn't Booker T. Washington your prom date though? How old do you think I look? I mean, you look at least 52. You meant to switch it around, right? 25, mm -mm. right? Not 50, yeah. Nope. Yo, y'all wanna see my high school yearbook? Didn't you graduate the same year as Betty White though? Like I could've sworn No, that. she was a grade above me. I'm way younger than her. I'm telling y'all, 95 is the new 25. Excuse me, ladies, are you guys in line for the bathroom? We're or? not sisters. We are not sisters. I'm literally her mom. I know we look like sisters. Y'all don't know nothing about Teach Me How to Duck. Huh? Nobody Ew. wanna listen to that senior citizen music. What? Like The sky is blue. What? Oh You're a liar. Where are you always lying, lying bro? Like, she always lying. lying. Smiley, you like, come on now. You know the sky day. has like, no color. Lying. Like, like the sky is the clearly truth. green. Like, like what are you talking about? Truth, like, you're a liar. Like you. The why sky is not blue. You always gotta lie. Like, you never tell the truth. Like, smile. Where have you been? Really? Really? That's how it is? That's really how it is. You really finna ghost me like that, right? So you just gonna leave me out to dry? Don't make me angry. Don't make me angry like you already did. That's why you be struggling every lesson. Every time I ask you to spell Manzana, you can't even do something as simple as that. Where you been at, huh? Huh? You know what's crazy? I think it's real funny that you could commit to a guy that be cheating on you, but you can't commit to us. What did I do to you? What did I do to you? Huh? Huh? Actually, you know what? It's 2024, new year, new me. You know, I'm, I apologize for getting mad at you earlier, boo. I just haven't heard from you. It's 24 hours. Is everything okay? Are you okay? We miss you. We love you. Por favor. Nah, I'm lying. You better come down your ass by yo or else. I'm not playing with you because it's finna be a real problem real quick. I better see you in 2024 or you finna be as tostada, tostada, as stupida. I don't care. <sighs> You guys, get ready with me to go to the airport and my flight leaves in four minutes. You guys, I'm utterly so stressed out right now. I just came back from a brand trip with Zebra Beauty and now I have another brand trip in Tulum with Dorito Cosmetics. Like I am so drained right now. I literally filmed two YouTube videos today and fed my child. Like today was a lot guys. Like I am so drained. My anxiety is through the roof. Speaking of my child, hi baby. Oh yeah, I didn't tell you guys, I got a pet pig. I'm not sure what I'm gonna name her yet. My mom wanted me to name her Oink, but I'm thinking about Bacon or Porky. Like, is that tone deaf? Hey girl, can I ask you something? Yeah, what's up? Yes? What is your lip combo? Because I'm so obsessed, girl. Like, you have to tell me your lip combo. Girl, what? Why did you make- Hi, welcome to Raisin Cane's. Whoa, 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 Khadijah. Now, is that how we greet our lovely customers? You seriously about to make me yes! sick? Yes! Or you're fired. Bok, bok, bok. It's chicken o'clock. What can I get you? Chicken, chicken. Which combo you picking? Go ahead. <laughs> I'll take the clucking sandwich combo. Welcome to Raisin Cane's. If the chicken ain't kicking, then girl, you must be tripping. What can I get you? Let me get a five-piece combo. Whoa! Whoa! What are you doing? I just asked you for chicken. You should have said that. Like, what you okay, well, you should have said that. You gotta be trying to beat with me. Hi, can I get a box combo with no coleslaw, please? No, because you decided to wear Ugg boots today. What the Let me get a box combo with extra coleslaw. Extra? Welcome to Cane's. If the chicken ain't clucking, then nuck if you bucking. Go ahead. Um, can I get a box combo with no sauce, please? Just the chicken only? Sir, I think you need the sauce. No, I really don't want the sauce. I, I'm fine, I'm fine. I don't need you it. You do need the sauce. Why do you, I need the really sauce? You really do need the sauce. You can't eat it without it. Yo, Rasputia, where's my combo at? I've been waiting here mad long. Well, I'm gonna give you that combo, all right? Where? <laughs> all right, who can tell me what five minus That's two so is? Ooh, ooh, I know. Michaela. Three. 
wrong. What? Well, I know, <laughs> I, know, I, know, I, know, I got it. I got it's it. Wrong. Okay, so five minus two is if you take the square root of cheese and pretzels and put five physical apples on the table and then place them in a position right next to each other and physically remove two apples and discard two of them in the trash can. Then you hand deliver the apples to Jamaica Queens and then they put them in the garbage chute, leaving those two apples into a disintegration of nothingness. Then if you take the square root of Nicki Minaj and multiply it by Ice Spice, you get gra three times and leaving that as a remainder. Once you confirm those two apples have disappeared, then that means you have three physical apples that are left on the table. So the answer is three. Correct. That's what I'm looking what? for. What? That's what I just said. I said five minus two is three. That literally makes no sense. You didn't sense show your work. That's what? why it's wrong. You, you didn't show your that work. No <sighs> okay, I could do this. I could do this. Uh, no. No. Um. <sighs> okay. B -b 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 back door? Did she really just say back door? She let her off. Gotta get off. <laughs> I, I I pulled the yellow the yellow string. Wait no! Dang! I would never show no, that. I said that's about it. Dang! Do you need help? Did you see that turtle video? What video? Here, just look, it's really funny. Are you serious? I just saw Hey, can you toss me my water bottle? Uh, absolutely not. I just got these carpets done and you're so clumsy. I don't want water leaking everywhere. You don't need to worry about that. Contigo water bottles are 100% leak proof and the spout cover protects the spout from dirt and grime. And the best part is how durable it is. Look, put it to the test and throw it to me. Okay. See? Oh wow, no spillage, okay. Hi, my beautiful delicious baddies. I have been getting so many requests to do a what's in my bag video and we're doing it today. I am so sorry for the goofiness. I am just so excited. Oh my goodness, please do not judge me. These are my literal holy grail items. First thing is obviously gonna be my wallet. Let's see how much I have in here. Nothing. Next is my lotion because I always need to stay moisturized. Next is obviously going to be my onion in case I get hungry. Like who doesn't have an onion in their purse? Next up is mustard. I mean, duh, if Beyonce keeps hot sauce in her bag, I'm keeping my mustard in my bag. Next is my water bottle. I have to stay hydrated. Next is obviously my wig. You never know when you're going to have a bad hair day, ladies. Okay, this next one is a little bit heavy. Ugh. Next, I have my vacuum. You never know when you're going to make a mess. I mean, who doesn't have a vacuum in their purse? Next is my 10 foot ring light. I mean, what kind of influencer would I be if I didn't have a 10 foot ring light in my purse? Next is my office chair in case I- Okay, and finally, this is the weirdest thing I have in my purse. Don't judge me, okay? But a hair tie. I know, I'm so weird. Like who carries a hair tie? Like, oh my- Comment down below for what more videos you want to see from me next. Bye. Look at that girl's hair. Whoa. Hey boo, I really love your hair. It looks so pretty. That was Thank my line. Thank you. I can't believe that's your real hair. It looks so long and beautiful. That's definitely hair goals, boo. Yeah, girl, your hair's so pretty. Actually, it's not my real hair. No way. It's a wig. <gasps> what? No way. Get out of town. I'm not going anywhere. That's crazy, boo. It really looks like your real hair. It looks so nice. You gotta be playing. It's a wig. I promise you. Look. <gasps> no way. Wow. Whoa. And it's glueless, too? That's crazy. Thank you. Girl, it's your line. Oh, uh, I know girlies don't get heat. Where did you get the wig? Well, I got it from Sugar Booger Hair. They're having a really big sale right now. No way. That is so crazy. Wait, what are my lines again? I have to go now. You should. Are you sure that's not your real hair? I still can't believe it. Wow, that's crazy. No. Are you always this difficult? Only for you. Hello? Hi, welcome to the Boyfriend Store Customer Services. Can I help you? Yeah, I would like to make a return. Okay, what are you returning? I'm returning my boyfriend. What's wrong with him? Well, I'm bored and I want a new boyfriend for Valentine's Day. I don't think this one's for me. Not for you? Well, he's too nonchalant, he doesn't let me become a passenger princess, and he chews too loud. Ma'am, I'm sorry, you can't return him. All sales are final, even if you're not satisfied. What? But I'm not satisfied. He chews too loud and cries at reality TV shows. I'm not satisfied. I need my emotional time and money back. Ma'am, this isn't like returning your car at CarMax. We can't just give you your money back for it. What? Within 30 days, up to 1,500 miles, even if you're not in love. Fine. I'm going somewhere else. Okay, we'll have a good... Oh, and by the way, you guys can learn a thing or two from CarMax. It's way better. 
and they wear those fresh polos. <laughs> Up to 1,500 miles within 30 days, huh? So I'm seeing that trend on TikTok where people are talking about some, oh, I'm convinced nobody has ever seen this show. But y'all be naming the most basic shows that everybody has seen. Y'all be like, oh, I bet you guys haven't seen Totally Spies. <laughs> Get out of here. I haven't seen one person talk about this show. This show used to give me nightmares. Y'all not touching Ubi. Y'all kidding me. Like, I remember my, I was so scared I was not allowed to watch this. My grandma thought it was weird. <laughs> and she would not let me watch it. <laughs> Y'all not touching Ubi, like. <sighs> oh, great, finally. Hi, mommy. Novea, come get your backpack. Oh, sorry, I forgot. You got everything? Yep, everything's in my bag. I love you. Love you too. You're not gonna say bye to daddy? Bye, dad. Yeah, I love yeah, you, yeah. I'll see you next weekend. Hi, right, give me a hug, be good. I will. Hi, mommy. My sugar wooga booga, you're finally safe from that monster. Get inside while I go talk to your daddy, okay? Okay. All right, put your seatbelt on. Okay. You can call daddy if you need anything, all right? Okay. <clears throat> Shanice. Clifford. I told you, I go by Lil Booga now. Oh, wow. Look at you finding another temporary career. Hopefully this one generates income so you can actually pay child support for once. Oh, don't worry, shorty, it will. Because I got 36 views on my TikTok video. I'm really up next, so... First of all, that's not the hairstyle that I dropped her off with. And did she even take a bath and do her homework? Um, she never asked me for one, so no. Clifford, how you not gonna give your child a bath? Like, so we just not taking a bath go. now? See, this what? is what I be talking what? about. Oh my gosh, Shanice, you mad bitter. You so you bitter, never like, do your you part. You it don't matter. It don't it matter. It don't matter. It don't matter. It don't matter. Yes, it do. You no, stay no. doing See, that's why she got my like... last name and not yours. You know what, Shanice? See, why this is why you evil. evil. You evil. You All them crystals father. that you be rubbing together and listening to that Jenna Ayuko music, and you still evil. And you still can't get a man. Because you evil. You evil, Shanice. You evil. I'm the bad guy. I'm a get for custody. How? You forever broke, Clifford. I told you it's booger now. That's not what the judge called you, so. Okay, step Ugh. forward a little bit and close your eyes. Shauna, you gotta make this quick. I gotta go to work. Open them. What in the... What? Is this for somebody else or... Uh... Okay. I brought you here. Yeah, why? Because I want to ask you something. You couldn't do this over iMessage? You know, we've been dating for 10 years. Yeah, so why ruin what we got going and, on? And, you know, we've been through a lot. And you're like the man of my dreams. And I know you said that good things come to those that wait. Mm -hmm, yes. And I feel like this is the perfect opportunity. Is this a skit? Um, like. <laughs> um, okay. La Frederick. We've been together for so long. I mean, yeah, that's what a situation ship is. Yes, you did cheat on me and you had seven kids on me, but I'm willing to raise those kids as my own. You already and do. I'm willing to give you all of my paychecks. You do that too. And I'm willing to be your doormat for the rest of our lives. You already are. The Frederick. Don't do it. Don't don't Will lean you down. Marry Wait, me? please don't tell me. No, no. Oh gosh. Uh can I get back to you on that? Because um I'm just trying to I'm waiting on to hear back from somebody else. Um yeah, but if she said no, um, then I'm a, then I'm gonna say yes. We could take a little rain check on that. Um, you can get up now. You know, if you if you want to let me know, how long is that gonna take? I'm gonna let you know in like five years. I promise, five years is the max. I'm gonna let you know. Um, I'm gonna give you an yes, update by it, then. It's worth the wait. It, it's you worth so understanding for that. Mm -hmm. Thank you, babe. Yes. I love you, babe. That's why yes. I love you. That's um, why I love you, babe. Girl, why did you ghost that man? I thought it was good. Because he started crying in the middle of the movie. Like, who does that? See, Ara, you acting like people don't cry during sad movies all the time. Like... During Mean Girls the musical? Nah, that's childish to me. Because as a man, why are you eating cashews? Right. Tell me how I went to go use his bathroom and the fan came on with the light. Like, I hate right? It. Like, that's too much for me. Like, that's too... Girl, why would you block him, though? Because he got a Roku TV. I can't date no man that's broke. Anaya, you acting like you don't got a fire stick yourself. Like, <laughs> I get it. Though, exactly. But... Like, when I saw them purple buildings, I was enraged girl right Asia, you can't expect a man to know everything girl i asked that man what the three branches of government were he said alvin simon and theodore what the chipmunks how you work on wall street but got brown cabinets like somebody lying ew wait so like what's your nationality i'm jamaican haitian dominican nigerian right, what what I do? baby make okay. sure you're wearing your shin guards okay, this time all right oh, love you Good my luck. gosh i know that ain't who i think it is oh Brenda? Hi, Sharon! Hi! Mwah. 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 I can't believe this. I was like, is that Brenda who used to eat her lunch in the school bathroom? And I was like, is that Sharon? In the flesh. AKA Mrs. I like to hang out with guys because it's less drama. Oh. How are you? 
up? I'm doing great. I saw that your car got repossessed last April. That's a big yikes. And I saw that you're on your third divorce on Facebook. Well, collecting those infinity stones, I see. Still have terrible credit and facing eviction, I see. But anyways, how are the boys? Very good. My oldest is going to college, so. That ran down community college right up the street? No, Harvard. Oh, wow, Harvard. I guess they're letting anybody in. Clearly, they're not letting everybody in there because your son has taken a gap year for 47 years now and he's still not in school. Ooh, oh, you gag me there. <laughs> Well, anyways, enjoy the game, Brenda. You too, Sharon. Bye. Desperate. Non-existent neck. Okay, guys. We are not going to... Ooh, I'm nervous, girl. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Please don't the say The Bronx? It. No! Oh! Man, that was the one I picked. Oh, I really wanted to go there. That was a good one. Okay. We are not going to... Nebraska. What? Are you kidding me? We missed out on Nebraska? Dang. Come on. Okay, we are not going to. Come on, y'all. Come on. Jamaica. I mean, I'm fine with that. Yeah, yeah that yeah, was easy. I yeah, 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 I don't. Yeah, want that must have been a throwaway. Jamaica Queens, y'all. No. no! Are you for real? I'm not going anywhere no more. I'm sick of this. Come game. on, y'all. We got bad luck. Okay, we are not going to. I don't want to look. Antarctica. Are you uh, serious? Me? That was fine. Oh. That was a good one. Come on. Okay, y'all. We are not going to Potato Heights. What? Oh, y'all, we on the good places, y'all. I don't want to go nowhere. Oh, no, no, no. Nah, I need to step out. I need to step out. Oh, I let's need to step just sit down. Okay, we are not going to Iguana Farms. Oh, I'm about Yo, to lose. Game is rigged. Are you kidding me? I really wanted to go there. Right. Nah, I'm getting mad now. All right, y'all. This is the last one. We are. Going to oh, this one's mine, y'all. What'd you put? Paris. Paris. What? Why would you Paris? Paris? I'm sorry, I can't really? come up with anything. So I you really literally one. picked something better. Oh like, my god! No, no, we, we, we we're not going this. there. We're gonna like, redo it. On, Everybody, grab a pen and paper. Hi, can I please get a name? Yes, my name Hi, is. I'm here for DoorDash. Hello, here for DoorDash. Olivia J. DoorDash. I'm sorry, Miss. Can you DoorDash. please repeat that? What were you trying to say? Here? My DoorDash. name is DoorDash. Sir, DoorDash. sir, excuse me. DoorDash. Excuse me, Olivia sir. Jay, her food at? Like, can y'all get sir, her food? Sir, listen. Where her food at? We just got the order two minutes ago, so you're gonna have to sit over there and wait. <laughs> Okay, Miss, what's your order? Um, okay, so can I have a 10 Dude, I'm at the restaurant doing a DoorDash order. What does it look like I'm doing? Why do you think I'm cheating all the time? I'm not cheating. You the one that put me on child support. These diapers ain't gonna buy itself, shorty. Like, shut up, shut up, shut Hello, up. Hello, sir. Shut up. Like, Hello. You're talking too much. Shut up. Can you please keep it down, oh, sir? Oh my gosh. Okay, so can I get mango habanero? Nobody with... knows me like you do. Sir, I just want to be nice. Please keep it down. Please keep it down because I'm trying to do uh, my, my job. My bad, my bad. I'm going to keep it down. I promise. DoorDash, your food is ready. Yeah, I don't plan it. 